Hey everyone, this is Ben from the Gaming Master, back again with some more Animal Crossing New Leaf. And today is actually a very exciting day in town because the new TNT store actually opened. So I believe this is the max version of Timmy and Tommy's store, which is awesome. I believe it's called like the TNT Emporium or something like that. So that'll be cool to go check out. <laughs> and I'm greeted with a pitfall. Let's go. Great start to the day. <laughs> now, but anyway, I am really excited to check out the new shop. That'll be very fun. So yep, here we go. From TNT Epor Emporium. Today marks the grand opening of TNT Emporium. We hope that it becomes the most visited store in town. Timothy and Thomas. Yeah, we'll definitely go check that out later today. Let's see like how much stuff we have in our pockets first. Because I suspected. You know what we're going to do really quickly? Before we go shopping, I want to make sure we have enough space in our pockets. And then we also still from yesterday have the... what was it? We still have some more bugs, that's right, to sell. From the last episode. So we'll have to go do that eventually today. So yeah, we got some things we can work on today. Uh, oh, but as you guys may know... Here, I'll change this on. Where's my hair? That's right. That works. That's a little better. As you guys know from yesterday, or not yesterday, but the previous episode, which was a couple days ago, we got another gold trophy. Literally, I have so many gold trophies, my table can't fit anymore. <laughs> no, that's cool. So, we got five bug off gold trophies now, which is kind of cool. So, I don't really know what I'm using this room for right now. It's just kind of a junk room, but I thought I'd display some awards in there, so. Alright, so we're up to as of now. Oh gosh, I gotta stop like mindlessly buying stuff. I'm like running out of room over here. Oh, okay. Well, that is interesting, but anyway, let's go ahead and uh, yeah, let's head to the TNT Emporium, baby. It's gonna be awesome. I'm probably pay off the bridge here. Do we just do that? You know what? Screw it. Let's do it. You know what? We're doing it. We're paying off this stupid bridge. I don't want to ever deal with this garbage again. Let's do it. Pay it off. We're doing it. Right now. Ready? 110,000 bells. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. The bridge is complete. And that's not even going to be the coolest thing we do today. Because we still got the cool shop to check out. So, that'll be very fun. But yeah, bridge is paid off now, which I'm happy with. Bones, it's been a while. Let's talk to you, bro. How's it going? <laughs> yes, it has been a bit. Can we talk? I hear that the right decor in your house can make napping three times as satisfying. Hey, I know. You should recommend some furniture to me. With your keen eye, cool guy, I'm sure you'll make my place look super cool. You know what, Bones? If I find something, you can have it. How about that, buddy? Hopefully that sounds quite alright with the man, the myth, the legend. Here, let's test this. No? Okay. A lot of weeds over here. What is happening? It's like Weed City over here. Goodness. Get these stupid weeds out of here. Get them all. There we go. Oh my god. It's like they keep multiplying. These things are gremlins. Get them out of here. There we go. Oh, come on. Really? How about here? No. Wow. Okay. He's getting disrespected over here. Whoa. Everyone's over here. Who is this? Is that a new villager? Drift? Oh, yeah, that's a Drift. That's right. Hey, I'm Drift. Are you the boss in this town? You certainly look strong, but don't go trying to start anything with me. Where I used to live, I was famous. People would run screaming at the sound of the name Drift. Of course, at the time, I did have a pretty bad body odor <laughs> problem. Anyway, from now on, we're pals and rivals. Nice to meet you. Okay. Yo, Ben, am I having deja vu, brah? Did we just talk? Talk to me. Man, I need a jogging body. Okay, so he's like the athletic type of villager. 
I need someone who can take off or run at the drop of a hat. Someone I can just be myself with. Like Bud and Curlis, that's exactly what I need. Haha, <laughs> I can't imagine the two of them jogging together, though. Yeah, he's like these... Oh, really? <laughs> really? Alright, time to bust out the painting, guys. Let's do it. Alright. Well, while we head on in here... ACNL painting guy, let's do it. Alright, Red. I refuse to get ripped off by you, so... Yeah, 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 let's get to it. Here, we'll do the paintings first. So let's take a look at this one. Then let me find this on my guide here. So let's uh, see. Okay, here it is. Oh, this is interesting. According to this guide, it says this painting is always genuine. Huh, interesting. We'll get to that in a second. And it's also kind of cool because I can kind of explain, like, what makes different things real and fake. If you guys are playing along with, so you can use this advice. So this is the mystic statue. If the top of her head is round at the top, it is fake. If her head is flat at the top, it is genuine. So, yeah, this is a fake statue, so do not buy that. It should be flat. Let's go back to the paintings. Let me find this one for you guys. Here it is. If the woman in the painting is holding a white cat, it is fake. If she's holding a white ermine, it is genuine. Okay, so that's a cat. So that's a fake painting. And then how about this painting? The one with the carrot nose. I think we've seen this one before. The portrait's nose is made out of a carrot, and there are leaves hanging, it is fake. If the nose is made of a green vegetable, it is genuine. So, it does appear that this is the correct painting, and apparently it's always genuine, which is kind of awesome. So let's go ahead and place our order, because I don't think we have that one yet. Alright, thanks, Shred. <laughs> Get this little rip-off guy out of here. Try to rip me off like that, buddy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cousin, get out of here. <laughs> You're gonna sell me fakes. We ain't friends. Get out of here. We don't need that nonsense. Bro, talk about a good episode. We put off the bridge. We got a real painting, hopefully. We found a new villager. We're gonna go to the TNT Aporium. This is a pretty action-packed episode, actually. Always fun when we got a lot of things going on. Oh, yeah, it's gonna take five years. <laughs> I just do it this way. We're gonna get, like, nothing for the fruit, but might as well get it out. Oh, there. And we should be able to make it in one more trip, so. Maybe just, like, two trips at retail and we should be good. Oh my god, the weeds! <laughs> no! Get these weeds out of here! Bro, this is insane. Okay, I think this is Drift's house. We've got to go in there, but... Hopefully she'll go in her house sometime so we can actually check that out. Alright, fossil, cool. I can't carry it, what? Oh yeah, I just totally filled my pockets, that's why. Duh. Don't know why that didn't occur to me, because I literally just did it. Alright, Reese. You know the drill. I give you stuff that takes you like five minutes to catch, you give me a ton of money. <laughs> and we're gonna go with it. Excellent. Excellent. There we go. I expect to be well paid for this. 63,000? Oh my god, no! Okay. That's the only thing I don't like about this game is that you you press B to actually, like, make the conversation go faster. But it's also, like, the basically like, the no or the cancel out button. Let me know if that happens to you guys a lot, because it happens to me all the time. It's super irritating. There we go. That's a bit better. Alright, Reese, thank you for your service. 
Can we maybe make this in like one more trip? If we could do it in one ship, that'd be pretty cool. Oh, there's a fossil here too? <laughs> I'm definitely not gonna have enough room. Come on, man. Really? Oh, dude. What was that even about, Rizzo? Uh, can this be done? I don't think so. Uh, not quite. <laughs> Come on. You know what? Here. I'll drop two things and then I'll come pick it up later. Here. Put that on the ground. Put that on the ground, dude. Come on. I don't have time for this nonsense. Ground, ground, perfect. Alright, give me those last two bugs. Thank you. Alright, that's better. Some more like it. Alright, back to retail. Well, go get that other fossil, we'll go pick that stuff back up, and then we'll head to Main Street for the remainder of the episode. Because we'll have fossils, we'll have... Freaking the new store to check out. It'll be good. Okay, come here. And have all of this. Perfect, dude. Nearly a hundred grand for that nonsense. Let's go. 234? And that doesn't even include today's money rock. Heck to the yes. Let's go. Alright, Winnie, excuse me. Alright, back down to the beach. Let's go grab that really quickly. Then we'll be on our way. Let's do this. <laughs> Why is Trissa holding a watering can on the beach? Explain yourself. Nice weather, huh, Ben? Nice days put me in a nice mood, you know? Squee. So what's up? Let's chat. Hey, you like to fish, right? I have a favor to ask, so hear me out. I want you to catch and bring me an ocean fish. Any kind will do. What do you think? Easy, right? You know what? If he's not going to be, like, super specific about it, we might as well just do it really quickly. Because he even said any kind will do. And I'm literally by the ocean, so... It's hard to turn down that request if it's that easy. Although there's, like, no fish. What? You're telling me there's not a single fish in this entire ocean. I beg to differ. Yo, what? Uh... <laughs> what? Oh, oh. Whoa, 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 what? Yo, what? A shark? Obviously, Rizzo's not getting this. Dude, I thought sharks only come out at night time. Apparently sharks can be found at day too, huh? That is interesting. Oh, come on, dude. God, I hate sharks in this game. Can't ever catch them. Oh, please be like a sea bass for <laughs> Rizzo. <laughs> Let's go, dude. And there's the sea bass. Okay, that's actually hilarious. Alright, buddy. Hey, you said anything. I'm taking your word for it. Take the fishy fishy. Whoa, a sea bass, thanks. A nebula shirt. No clue what this is. Hey, do you owe me one, buddy? Especially if the shirt isn't good. Which it is questionable. 
It's fine, I guess. It could have been way worse. That's right, fine. Thank you, Rizzo. Alright, we really gotta get a move on here. Let's check it. No, come on. Oh, ready? Right here. No. Oh, no. There's only two rocks that we haven't checked yet, and one of them is a disaster. Of course. <laughs> of course. Of course. Why wouldn't that happen, you know? Alright. Main Street, here we come. Alright, fossils, and then the shop. Let's do it! Yeah, look at that thing. That thing is massive! This is gonna be pretty epic. Pretty epic indeed. Brothers? Wake up, good sir! Ooh, I do believe I have something, found something. Okay, so a new fossil, too. Dude, this is such a good episode. So much is happening. We got the bridge paid off. We're getting a ton of bells. We actually got new fossils. We're gonna go check out the new shop. This is a good episode, dude. <laughs> this is awesome. The money rock situation was unfortunate, but, you know. The Stego Torso. Awesome. It's been a bit since we've actually gotten a new fossil. Okay, so now that I donated this fish, I want to see if we got the silver rod yet. No. <laughs> Come on, dude. Why? That stupid thing better be there eventually or I'm going to be pretty upset. Oh, that's... It's garbage, but what are you going to do about it? Alright, the TNT Eporium. You guys ready for this? I know I am. Because this story is actually really cool. Let's check it out, shall we? The TNT Emporium. Look, sliding doors. How cool is that? I always thought that was a really neat touch. And look, they got, like, suits now. They're in business business. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to TNT Emporium. Come on in. So look, Leaf actually combined his shop with him. So that's kind of cool. So let's talk to Tommy here. In order to entice our customers to visit every day, we replace our stock on a daily basis. Yes, yes. Oh, how can I help you? Oh, I want to sell. Yes, yes, of course. Oh, no, I don't want to sell. I thought maybe you'd say something. I don't want to sell. Get out of here. Ah, hey yeah, hey yeah, but isn't bad. The shop is lovely, right? And it's so packed with happy products. Timmy and Tommy said they were both expanding the shop, so I had them make a little space for me. I've got a lot more floor space for new items, so come by often to see what sort of happy things I'll have. Yeah, so check this out. So I forget what the order is, but if you buy like, I want to say maybe it's 60? If you buy like a certain number of the fertilizer bags, you would get like either a gold shovel or a golden axe. And the same if you buy these plants, I believe. If you buy a certain amount of these, you actually get either a golden shovel or a golden axe. I forget which one it is, but... It's a little fun fact for you guys. Might as well check out the fortune cookies. Let's buy these really quickly. Let's do it. Alright, come on, what do we get? What do we get? Fortune cookie. There's a fortune side loot seat. Sometimes a flower is just a flower unless it causes... <laughs> what could that be? A fire flower, maybe? 
Never count your Yoshis before they hatch. Plans often change. Okay, so that's like the Yoshi egg. Call on both of them. Let's do it. Lucky ticket, baby. Alright, I will claim my prizes. Thank you, Mr. Whatever your name is. Bye, man. Yep, Yoshi's egg. Alright, we're almost done here. Fortune 20, there we go. Alright, let's do it, dude. There we go. Got the second floor here. Nice, this is where Timmy's have shop. This is the second floor of the interior design for. Cool. Alright, looks cool. Let's check out Gracie's shop, which is up here. So this is why we actually had to do stuff with Gracie. Nice, so this is Gracie's shop. But isn't you? Aren't you a cypher sore eyes? Thanks to you, I've decided to open my boutique here in town. You got style, but you're not a fashionista yet. Consider my shop to be your new classroom. Now then, you simply must feast your eyes on these trendy designs, courtesy of yours truly. <laughs> okay. She's got some stuff. That's kind of cool. I'll buy these shorts, I guess. Some brown plaid shorts. Must try. Oh, uh, there we go. Sure, we'll stick with that for a bit. I'll buy it, sure. Alright, thanks. Well, guys, we're gonna end it here, so thank you guys. Oh, every trendsetter who makes a purchase today receives a free novelty gift. Oh, let's tuck it in with your other belongings. Okay. Oh, the mannequin. That's right. We got the fourth mannequin. That's going to be awesome. Forgot about that. Yeah. So you actually get four mannequins in this game, which is awesome. We're going to end it off here, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to drop a like, share the video with a friend, drop a comment, and subscribe for more. And we'll cross a new leaf. And I'll talk to you guys on the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching, and have a good rest of your day. See ya.